Hello guys and welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Imru and today I will be reviewing the most recent book I've read called Blackout by Simon Scarrow. Now before we get to the actual to the actual review, I just wanted to let you know that if you would like to keep up with me, please follow me on my social media right here. Instagram and TikTok and if you like this video please don't forget to like and comment below and subscribe to my channel for more <coughs> now um I believe that was nine pounds um from any bookshop that you can find like it's very easy to find but if you would like I can provide you the link um, in the description so that you can buy it yourselves. Um, just a warning, this is not sponsored, it's just me because I'd like, I mean I really love that book so I wanted to share my um, views with you guys. So it's not sponsored but if you would like to buy it yourselves I will have um, the link below in the description. So let's get into the review. Before I start talking about how I found it, I think I ought to tell you a bit about the plot. So the plot basically is a famous German inspector called Horst Schenke is assigned to solve the murder of a famous actress, um, Gerda Korsny, I believe it's a name i can't pronounce it it's german but you get the point um however this investigation leads to a darker greater bigger mystery in berlin of the second world war so it takes place in berlin in december 1939 so it's right at the beginning of the Second World War. Now, in terms of the plot, I found it very interesting and very engaging. It was complex. It is a murder mystery, but it's it was quite easy to follow, if that makes sense. Um, and yeah, it's a murder mystery, so there's a lot of blood, a lot of mystery, a lot of murders definitely <laughs> um uh, which can be a bit intense and we're talking about a period where i mean the second world war was not fun for anyone um so it's a bit dark um but in all fairness i just i could not like put it down i was literally just so into it um and one thing i quite liked about it was that the chapters were quite short and like I finished one chapter and could easily finish like four or five chapters at the same day on the same day pardon me um, so I just found it very easy to read and it was just so interesting and engaging as a plot it just it literally hooked me on the book for as long as I read it Right. Now, in terms of the writing style, I would describe it as very plain, like <clears throat> it's very literal um, and the author does not use any kind of metaphorical language or anything like that. It's very easy to comprehend, language is very simple um, and I think that goes perfectly with how complicated the plot is. So even though the plot is complicated, the language being that easy and that simple makes it very easy to follow, very easy to comprehend. And I would say that sometimes this is dangerous in terms of it can be quite boring or quite dull um, if you're reading a book that's just too, you know, too literal, too plain. But I would say that this one specifically is not like that by any means. Like. It's not dull, it's not boring, 
at all, even though it's just very simple, very plain in, in terms of language. Um, I would say that it's that does not make it boring at all because it, the plot itself is very rich on its own. So it doesn't really need any help with the linguistic aspect to kind of elevate it, if that makes sense. Yeah. But all in all, I think I would 100% recommend it to anyone who likes uh, murder mystery or historic fiction. It is quite intense in terms of the war and a lot of like, it's very, re the war is very realistically depicted in the book. Like, there's a lot of things going on and on top of all of those things, the war is at its peak, so it, it is quite intense. But I would say it's a very enjoyable reading, not in, not as in, you know, oh, I really enjoyed it because it was relaxing. Um, it's not relaxing exactly because obviously it's a crime, uh, like it is a crime book, but um, I'd say it's really interesting and I would 100% recommend it to anyone who um, would like to give it a go because it's very interesting it just it was very it was one of the best books i've ever read if that makes sense i just really liked it and i think you might like it too anyway guys that was it for this video it's quite short because i really don't know what else to say about that it was a great book i think it was amazing and I would really like to like spread awareness on that book because I find I found it very very interesting. Um, now, if you liked that video, please like and comment below, um, and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of me. And of course, don't forget to follow me on Instagram and TikTok if you want to keep up with me. That's it. I hope you have a wonderful time and I'll see you in the next one.